All right, this is uh, this is part B. Um, I figured I'd tell you that I, I made it out of the graveyard. It actually did turn out to be a really nice little campground. Uh, actually, a lot nicer and bigger than I thought. It ended up that I was in like the I was uh, tenting solo in the uh, group campsite, and uh, nothing really creepy happened. There was stuff walking around my tent at night. I want to just hope that was deer. Uh, and I think the creepiest thing is I woke up to a uh, an old lady staring at me from like across the way but that's as uh, that's as scary as that got so uh, anyways just uh, trekking through Washington still and uh, I found this little spot here pretty slick pretty sweet views uh, yeah that's the road I came up on and um, yeah oh and that's the bike right there it's a workhorse it's uh, it's really pulling it all out for me this trip so anyways I just thought I'd let everybody know that I didn't die overnight. Um, that was really freaky though. I really had no idea where that was. But um, I don't know. It was like midnight, so I figured I just uh, I had to stop somewhere. So um, anyways, I'm going to continue on. I still haven't picked a destination. Winthrop was really cool, actually. Nice little town and yeah, really friendly people. And I chatted with a couple of old boys there at the museum for a while. So anyways, that's... Uh, that's it. I just, uh, I'm going to try not to fall down this cliff, sheer cliff. And, um, yeah, I will see you back in Vancouver.